Hello and welcome to day 40 of our 2790 series. Today we're going to be reading Acts chapters 25, 26, and 27. Uh, this is Paul's trial uh, for being, for usurping the Roman government, so to speak, but really this kind of mock trial because he represents Christ and the Jews are opposed to that in the region. And so they're going to continue to hand Paul off from person to person. No one really wants to deal with this. And Paul simply goes from person to person. He presents his argument of what happened. He even gives a witness to what happened to him on the road to Damascus. Uh, and in the end, he's waiting. And finally, at the very end, he plays his ace of spades, which is, uh, I appeal to Caesar. And Paul reveals that his real purpose in all of this is to bring the gospel for the transformation of the entire world. And he knows that there's no better place for him to present this gospel than to Rome. He's inten intentionally going to Rome to convert the Roman people and the, the emperor himself uh, unto Christianity that the whole world might be transformed uh, for the Lord Jesus Christ. He knows when he tells them that he appeals to Caesar that the trial in Judea is over and uh, he's gonna be going on a ship. He's never going back to Ephesus. He's never going back to Corinth. He's going to Rome. Uh, and he knows that that's probably going to be his last stop. He has a heart to go on to Spain, uh, and he talks a little bit about that, but in the end, he's pretty sure that this is going to be his final stop. And so he gets on his ship, and uh, while he's setting forth for Rome, there's a great storm at sea. The ship is wrecked and ends up on the island of Malta, uh, and it's just astounding to me how uh, a man of God like Paul can have this vision for what he's to accomplish, set forth to accomplish that vision, but the trials never stop, but the things that get in the way never stop, and Paul just keeps his eyes set straight toward what God's calling him to do. He gets a shipwreck, but he knows he's going to Rome, and it's just a, a temporary stop. So you enjoy uh, as we near the end of the book of Acts.